Hi guys, welcome to the Flight Ash channel. The promoter of the WBC World Heavyweight Champion Tyson Fury appealed to his colleague Shady Hearn with a request that he refuse a rematch between his ward Anthony Joshua and the WBA, WBO and IBF champion Alexander Rusik. The head of the top ranked promotion company Bob Arum believes that WBA, WBO and IBF world heavyweight champion Alexander Rusik will defeat Anthony Joshua in a rematch. Recall that Anthony Joshua and Alexander Rusik held a duel on September 25 at the Tottenham Hotspur Arena in London. The victory was won by Ukrainian by a unanimous decision of the judges. Tyson Fury and Dante Wilder will share the ring for the third time on October 9 at the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas, Nevada. The promoter of the WBA, WBO and IBF heavyweight champion Alexander Usyk, Alexander Krasyuk, claims that Anthony Joshua should activate the rematch option within a month. Krasu claims that his colleague Eddie Hearn, who deals with the affairs of Anthony Joshua, gave his word only three or four rounds after the fight with the Ukrainian. Eddie Hearn, the promoter of champion Anthony Joshua, commented on the desire of WBA, WBO and IBF title holder Alexander Usyk to have a rematch with his word in Kiev. According to Hearn, he is ready to consider such an option. And Joshua is also not against fighting in Ukraine. WBC heavyweight world champion Tyson Fury believes that Anthony Joshua will have chances in a rematch with Alexander Usyk, but at the same time noted that AJ needs to do serious work on mistakes after the first fight. Friends, before starting to watch this video, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel. If you really enjoy the content, then please subscribe to my channel and keep watching the videos. If you are subscribed, then you receive notifications about the release of new videos. You do not even have to look for anything personally. I really want to get 10,000 subscribers on my channel. I am trying very hard absolutely every day and I need your support. Your likes, comments, reposts to social networks. Thanks to everyone who subscribes to my channel. You are my support. Thank you so much. The promoter of the WBC World Heavyweight Champion Tyson Fury appealed to his colleague Shady Hearn with a request that he refuse a rematch between his ward Anthony Joshua and Alexander Usyk. If Tyson wins against Wilder, then perhaps everyone will act wizardly and give the opportunity to arrange a fight for the title of undisputed champion between Fury and Usyk, with the condition that Joshua will meet the winner. Everyone will get their piece. Is that a bad thing? I think it's reasonable. I approached Eddie Hearn with this question and he was interested, but could not give an approving answer. We know that everything depends on Joshua. Anthony has the right to rematch with Usyk, but you need to be realistic. His chances in this fight are not great. He needs another fight, a new coach. Besides, if Usyk defeats Fury, then he will have the opportunity to meet him. And if Tyson wins, he will be able to take part in a big event, Aram said. Recall that Anthony Joshua and Alexander Usyk held a duel on September 25 at the Tottenham Hotspur Arena in London. Their victory was won by a Ukrainian by a unanimous decision of the judges. Tyson Fury and Dante Wilder will share the ring for the third time on October 9 at a T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas. The head of the top-ranked promotion company Bob Arum believes that the WBA, WBO and IBF World Heavyweight Champion Alexander Usyk will defeat Anthony Joshua in a rematch. I was not surprised by Usyk's victory at all. I am his great friend because of Lomachenko. I spent a lot of time with Alexander. He is extremely smart, funny and terrific guy. But I also know that he is an excellent technician, just like Lomachenko. They were taught by Vasily's father. So I am not surprised at all that he did such damage to Joshua. If they fight again, the something will be happen. Bob Arum said in an interview. The promoter also spoke about the potential fight of the WBC title holder Tyson Fury with Usyk. Unlike many big heavyweights, Tyson Fury knows how to box, and this negates some of the advantages of Usyk. However, Usyk is a very good boxer and even a lefty, 
a lot of heavyweights don't have a lot of confidence when they fight lefties. Arum added. The promoter of the WBA, WBO and IBF heavyweight champion Alexander Uksik, Alexander Krasiuk, claims that Anthony Joshua should activate the rematch option within a month. There may be a lot of objective reasons for the cancellation of the rematch, but according to our plans, agreements fixed on paper, the rematch shouldn't take place within 7 months from the date of the fight. Within 30 days, Joshua must activate the rematch option in writing, that is, confirm it. Although he has already verbally activated it right in the ring, he came up, I told him. My friend, congratulations, it was a fantastic fight, you have the heart of a warrior. And he waved his hand, turned around and replied, see you at the rematch. Whether there will be a rematch depends on many circumstances, but as of today we have no other plan but to prepare this fight, Krasiuk said. Alexander Krasiuk claims that Eddie Hearn, who deals with the affairs of Anthony Joshua, gave his word only three or four rounds after the fight with the Ukrainian. Twelve rounds is an obvious victory, which did not cause any wind-ups. As we were climbing into the ring, Eddie Hearn said, Three or four rounds, meaning how many rounds Joshua took, somewhere like that. According to my notes, Joshua had four rounds, although I always try to judge to objectively. But the victory was unconditional. Then, when we got into the ring, I looked deep into the eyes of the one of the super wizards, saw approval there and was already waiting with a calm soul for the official announcement of the result. Krasiuk said. Alexander Krasiuk, the promoter of Alexander Usyk, said that the Ukrainian's team would be pleased if Anthony Joshua decided to measure boxing skills with him in the rematch. It was difficult to imagine a different outcome. Joshua's only chance to win is to knock out Usyk. He chose the tactic of reboxing Alexander and made the mistake. We would like him to learn how to box for a rematch in three months and continue to compete in this element with Alexander Usyk. The outcome of the duel is obvious, clear. In principle, it looked like according to the script, the conductor in the corner conducts and the orchestra in the ring performs. Usyk himself said that when in the third round he applied and hit the jaw, he started up, felt blood. Therefore, he returned to the corner and the coach said in his calm voice, Sasha, stop, follow the plan, Chris Hook said. Eddie Hearn, the promoter of former world heavyweight champion Anthony Joshua, commented on the desire of WBA, WBO and IBF title holder Alexander Usyk to have a rematch with his words in Kiev. According to Hearn, he is ready to consider such an option and Joshua is also not against fighting in Ukraine. Usyk mentioned Kyiv in his native country, Ukraine, as a potential venue for a rematch, and we will consider all options. When Joshua heard about it, he had no problem with it. He found it very exciting. I would like to have a rematch in the United Kingdom. We also have offers from the Middle East, but we will see which opportunity will be the best for both fighters. I don't think a venue of the fight will greatly affect how Joshua should fight, Eddie Hearn wrote. WBC heavyweight world champion Tyson Fury said he was not surprised by Anthony Joshua's defeat and a fight with Alexander Usyk. In fact, I wasn't surprised by Usyk's victory over Joshua. In an interview before the fight, I said that I predict such a result. After a few rounds, Joshua ran out of ideas. Tyson Fury said in an interview. Thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel.